Lean thinking involves specifying value, lining up activities in the most effective sequence, conducting activities without interruption whenever pulled to do so by customer demand, and continuously seeking ways to improve. Defining value. In order to better understand this principle of defining customer value, it is important to understand what value is. Value is defined as what customers are willing to pay for a product or service. It is absolutely essential to discover what the actual needs of the customer may be. At times, customers may not know what they want or may have a difficult time articulating it. This is especially common for novel products or technologies. There are many techniques such as interviews, surveys, demographic information, and web analytics that can help you decipher and discover what customers define as valuable. Mapping the value stream. The second principle within lean manufacturing is identifying and mapping the value stream. Within this step, the goal is to use the customer's value as a reference point and identify all the activities that contribute to these values. If there are activities that are considered to not add value, then this is considered also considered as waste and should be eliminated. The waste can be broken into two categories, non-valued added but necessary and non-value unnecessary. Creating flow. Once you remove waste from the value stream, the following action is to ensure that the flow of remaining steps run smoothly without interruptions or delays. Some of these strategies for ensuring that value-adding activities flow smoothly include breaking down steps, reconfiguring the production steps, leveling out the workload, creating cross-functional departments, and training employees to be multi-skilled and adaptive. Establishing pull. When it comes to inventory, it is considered one of the biggest waste within any production system. The entire goal of pull-based systems is to limit inventory and work in process, WIP, items while ensuring that the requisite materials and information are available for a smooth flow of work. In other words, a pull-based system enables for JEET delivery and manufacturing where products are created at the time that they are needed and in just the quantities needed. Pursuing perfection. In order to pursue perfection, you have to understand that waste are prevented through the achievement of the first four steps. Identifying value. Mapping the value stream. Creating flow. Adopting a pull system. However, the fifth step of pursuing perfection is the most important among them all. It makes lean thinking and continuous process improvement a part of the organizational culture.